Well, many schools did cancel today. Some decided to weather the nor'easter and have classes. And others split the difference and called for an early release. WBZ's Paul Burton is live in Framingham, where students got out early. But, Paul, I know just a few miles away in Natick, kids were in class all day. <laughs> and I can tell you right now that parents in both towns were happy with the school department's decision. It was coming out hard here in Framingham as soon as students would be released here from the high school. And you could tell they were ready to get out of Dodge. From 10.30 this morning, the snow started to fall hard in Framingham and has been accumulating ever since. All Framingham schools had a staggered early release day due to the storm. Roads quickly became snow covered as buses and parents hurried to pick up students and their children from school. The high school was the first to let out right before 11 a.m. Are you happy about it? I am happy about it. Uh, the kids were not comfortable if they would stay till 2 p.m. So I think it's the right choice. I think today was definitely a good call seeing where the, the snow is coming and there's elementary and middle school and elementary kids that still need to get picked up. So I think they made the right call. In Natick, public schools decided not to close early. When it started early, it was really heavy and it was collecting and it was on the cars and the roads and then it sort of eased up. So, you know, it just looked like it was going to be bad. <laughs> I'm sure for others that are commuting in or traveling places, it would be harder. Well, the snow has definitely let up here in Framingham. In fact, all, all is quiet. The students went home early. All parents are just going to watch to see how much more snow accumulates here in the Metro West area. In Framingham, I'm Paul Burton, WBZ News.